What's up guys, Philip Burgess here today. And for some reason, it's freaking cold here in the studio. So I got my Milwaukee M12 uh, heated shirt on or hoodie. Uh, if you don't have one, I highly suggest getting one. They're awesome. They have three different functions on here. You got your high, medium, and low. We're not here to talk about that today. We are here to talk about something that I told myself that I would never buy from Milwaukee and I ended up, ended up doing it. And I bought two of them. <laughs> I know, right? So this is Milwaukee's customizable packout workbench top. Retails for about $60. And that's one of the big things of why I did not want to buy one of these is because they're about $60. And the price on it is, I think is just uh, ridiculously high. And if you think so too, hit that like button or comment down below and uh, let me know what you think the price should be on these things. It has a marine grade top, which, you know, it's not that bad. But what I, I didn't realize is that this top does pop off. You can take this top off. If something happens to this top, you can replace it with another wood top. And right now I just have it sitting on uh, one of my pack out bins, but let's take it off and set this off to the side for a second. So I actually have been enjoying this uh, because I've been using this as a little workbench like it's supposed to be used. Uh, but it's really nice for, so when I have my pack out bins, uh, they sit about, you, you've seen them in, you've seen them in here, they sit about yay high. And put this on top and on the job site, when I'm putting light fixtures and stuff together, I can really kind of sort out different pieces, except especially when I'm hanging uh, crystals on a light and there's so many of them, I can kind of open up the individual packages and lay the crystals out on here on a, uh, piece of cloth and uh, you know, I don't have to reach very far from the ladder to grab them. So that, that's that been one of the main things I've been using this for. You know, there's multiple uses for it. You can mount a clamp or anything to this. It comes with six different screw holes that you can mount stuff to, or you can just drill right into this and screw into the wood itself. Now these screws go all the way through and they you get six of them and they come with Lock, lock or lock nuts on them, so uh, whatever you mount doesn't fall off. Now, when you get this, uh, I didn't know that these screws were in here. They're, they were actually underneath this board, and the slip or the this pack out that I got didn't have a slip on it, saying that there were screws underneath. Like I said, I bought two of them. The other one had a little tag on it that says that there was something underneath. So I pulled off the top and then got the screws and then, you know, pulled off this one and lo and behold, the screws were in this one. But one of the main things that I was like, you know what, that's a good idea. You could take this and you can mount any type of bin that you want onto it and pretty much make it pack out. So it can pretty much lock in to your pack out stuff. And as long, you know, it'll sit on, it'll be basically your top bin that you're gonna have on top of your pack out stuff. But you can lock it, lock this in because this will end up being your bottom plate and you can lock it in and then use it for all your pack out stuff. I thought this was really cool for my, for my camera gear uh, for the studio because uh, I actually take all of my equipment that I have for filming and I, after I do videos, I pack them up and I actually take them and uh, store them. This is really nice because all my stuff is in Pelican cases, but I would really like to actually convert it over to Milwaukee pack out cases. Uh, one of these days I might do that, just turn, put everything that I have in the Milwaukee uh, foam inserts cut all that stuff out and put them in different pack out bins and that will be my camera cases. But there's so many uses for this. And so what I'm doing is I bought two of these. I wanna send you one. So all you have to do is put a comment down below in, uh, put your, do a comment, say anything you want. But in that comment, put your Instagram feed and I'm only gonna pick a winner through Instagram. So if you don't have an Instagram account, sorry. And you have to be in the United States. 
So I won't ship this outside of the United States. It'll only be for US uh, residents. And uh, no, sorry, no PO box numbers. So put a comment down below and your Instagram handle and I will pick a winner in the next couple of weeks whenever I feel like it. But the winner will get one of these pack out customizable uh, workbench tops and uh, I'll send that to you. And uh, just kind of, you know, just trying to give back guys uh, for saying thanks for uh, being uh, a subscriber and uh, watching videos and uh, interacting and stuff. It's, this is a really fun, this is a blast doing. Let's keep this train moving. This is fun doing, I enjoy doing it. It's a great hobby. I digress. I will let you guys get back to doing what you've been doing and I will see you back on YouTube. And if you're not subscribed, subscribe and do so. Philip Bridges, talk to you later.